Alright, hi guys, I'm Fat Girl and welcome to Mermaid Swim, a horror based RPG. Right, I did record one previously, but the audio on it was terrible because I didn't, uh, did not have a microphone. But, da -da -da -da. I have one. I have been waiting like almost a month for these to come. Because uh, I got to, I got this one and I got a smaller one which actually does have better sound quality. But I thought use this one first. When it breaks, I have a better one. For them. Right. Anyway, enough about that. Um, let's play. Taking my face away because um, it's merely text the first part of the game. So let's have fun. This game contains grotesque and somewhat sexual images. Please be mindful of this as you play. The author takes no responsibility in advance for any trouble or damages indirectly brought by about by the game. You have been warned. <coughs> Rin Yamazaka. What the? Am I underwater? What the hell am I doing? Somebody there? Rin, wake up! Setaro Wakasube, stop sleeping already for crying out loud. Ah, shut up, I was just taking a nap. That's so bad. What hell of a nap Yuta. Uh, Yuta's been driving all this time and you've just been snoozing in the back. Sheesh, not a hint of a lady in this one. Not exactly interested in being ladylike for an early balding punk like you. Yuka Kikuchi. Rise and shine, Rin. I guess I'm going to guess you slept well, given uh, given you started around noon. Yeah, but thanks to Baldy here, more of a rude awakening. Quit your yammering, Yamazaki. Sssst. Hey Yuta, where are we anyway? You said something about kicking things into high gear, but are we in the mountains or what? <laughs> Yuta Takahashi. Haha, <laughs> my bad. I don't know where this is either. Huh? <laughs> You're telling me we're lost. Yep. Don't have a first clue where we are. You can't be kidding, you said the mountains were shortcuts, so I thought you knew the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kinda know at first, but the thug just got so thick. <laughs> this ain't funny, shrimp face. This is exactly why I didn't want to go on a no, on no trip with your lousy old GPS's car. Oh, don't keep the seat. Well, now what do we do? I can't even see any signs. Huh? Yuta, why did you stop? Because I did. I didn't... It just stopped. Hold on, I'll try the engine. Ah, uh, crap, I think it's totally busted. Say to, uh, say to, who are you for real, dude? You dumbass. Oh, uh, wait here, I'll go out and take a look.
Nothing looks wrong to me. Why the hell is it stuck? <gasps> Somebody there? Quite a surprise. What would you be doing up in these mountains, miss? <laughs> uh, just an old coat. Damn it, don't freak me out. We were on a trip, but our car went kaput, so I guess we're stuck. That's very unfortunate. Is there anywhere you can stay? Nah, if we can't get it raining, I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. You don't need that. My home is nearby. You can stay there. Even if it's summer, it's still quite cold in the nights. Oh, oh, oh. Huh? For real? Well, let me talk to my birds. Because I love a big bird. That's a relief. Thanks, old man. But you sure? You don't want to pressure you. Well, I'm a landlord around here, you see. My house is much bigger than my needs. I would appreciate some new folks to keep use of it. I'm really grateful we got the car fixed and uh, we'll get the car fixed tomorrow. Right. <sighs> ah, I can see it now. Whoa, this place is huge. Damn, now it's back to mansion. I can't feel grand back grand effects. <sighs> Whoa, it's really room inside too, right? You've got to be rich, am I right? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> rich enough to be ashamed of the state of this old place, perhaps. Come along, I'll show you to your rooms. You can use this room, uh, Miss Wynn. Forgive the old fashioned eh, It ain't nothing. I can't let the whole retro thing. Thanks, Gang Gramps. I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner. Until then, make yourself a cool. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Well, that's quite good. The fireplace. So, a large clock can be seen in the front of the house. Just valuables, maybe? There's nothing inside. Nothing inside. There's something like that. Let's go to other rooms. It ain't that old, old of a building, really. You see that other place out back? That's all. Huh? There's another mansion out back? The old man tells me they built, they built this one a generation ago because the other one was falling apart. Huh? Show me this house. A clock. A lamp. Ooh, nothing inside. Nothing inside. Nothing inside. Oh, that was drunk. Have you seen in front of the house? Oh. Nice. Your room has a dresser. I ain't got one in mine. It's a great design, isn't it? You can come over and do your makeup in the morning. Hey, thanks a bunch. <coughs> a light stand. A fireplace. Nothing inside. Hey, Rin, you see that big swamp in front? Yeah, you, the one you can see out of the windows? Super huge, isn't it? Maybe I'll go swimming tomorrow. Yeah, stay away from me after you do that, because you're gonna be... A trash pack. 
نظر می This is beautiful. Just beautiful. Less. Let's hear it. Just give me one second. It's locked. But why is it locked? Oh, toilet. <laughs> why is the toilet wall at the ceiling? Let's put my face back in. Right in there. Right in the top. Right in the top. Right in the top. Right in the Totally beautiful. Oh, just, just excuse it. It's a clock. Ah, my boot for this. The rice cooker. Hmm, I don't have much food. Mm. I have much food on hand for guests. Will chicken and egg on rice be all right? Well, I kind of so prefer something beefier. Like, literally beefier. Unfortunately, I'm out of beef. I must apologize. Oh well, I'll eat some, I'll eat anything on my stomach. Or maybe on my stomachs. <laughs> alright. Alright. The stove. Filled with plates and cooker. Filled with kitchen mess. You should walk around too much. Don't want grabs to find me and get mad. Right, now let's go take a nap. Take a nap! Maybe I should let them get I shoot you. Whoa, that's one big swarm. Hmm? What's this? A stone monument? Ah. A man did abduct from the seashore. Crap, I can't read this. Wait, then how the hell are you reading it? Maybe Satoru knows about this old stuff. Okay. So I clicked it to Curious about the monument? Oh. <gasps> yeah! Jeez, old man, you gotta not do that. Oh, my apologies. Did you read the inscription? No, I couldn't, couldn't make any heads or tails of it. What did it say? There's an old legend around here. The legend of the so called mermaid swan. Legend? It originated in the, mi in the middle of the Meiji era. Uh, uh, my family has governed this area since around that time. It is said the son of a leader descended the mountains down the seaside and discovered a mermaid. Sounds shady right out of the gates. Haha, <laughs> well, it is a legend. 
The man was so smitten with the mermaid's beauty he took her to his home. He created a fish tank for her to live in and filled it with water from this very swamp. But the mermaid of the sea cares not for swamp world. Uh, the mermaid grew weak and became quite ugly. Her skin swelled, her scales fell off, her voice as mel melodic as ringing bells was reduced to a beastly howl. The mermaid died and uh, took on the most repulsive form and subsequently died. And the mermaid's wrath is not a petty thing. Young women have vanished from a nearby village. It is said to be the mermaid's curse. As such, this monument was put up to mourn her. Then what would she do with the swamp in the first place? If she cares not for swamp water. Hmm, what do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting nonetheless. Yes? Ah, uh, sorry, don't know all about that. Tell it to say to her, he likes stones and stuff. Ah, is that right? Well, I've had dinner now, so come to the dining room if you would. Oh, finally, let's get a move on. Mmm, mm. 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 delish. This is some great stuff on my yum. Yum. Mm. I'm glad you like it. You can slow down a little though. The bath is free if anyone wants to use it. You must be tired from the day's events. Please rest yourselves. Mm. 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 Luca, aren't you gonna eat? What's up? Yeah, I guess I'm too tired to have an appetite. Oh, you okay? We'll clean up. You can get some rest. Alright, thanks, Yuta. <coughs> Yummy, y'all can clean up now. Why do we have to clean up after you? Do it yourself, Yummy Yuki. Yeah, what can you name you while you're at it? <laughs> Man, I'm stuck. I'm ready to come out after that bath. That's good sleep. Mmm, nice food. Mmm. Huh? Am I underwater again? It must be a dream. I mean, I'm not drowning and my eyes don't hurt. Can't move a muscle though. Somebody's there again. Who the hell is it? Stop staring at me. Sorry about that. So sorry about that. I'll kill ya! <laughs> Got some good sleep. One already? Hey, Yuka, it's morning. Wake up. Sorry, Rin, I'm feeling kind of cold. Can I rest a little longer? Alright, you're gonna be okay? Don't push yourself. Yeah, I'm fine. Maybe I could call it because of all that fog. Fog. Yeah. Yeah. Dang, you guys are up early. What's the deal? Early? It's already time. Even though, <sighs> even though the clock says either nine o'clock or quarter to twelve. But anyway, I checked the car. It's still not looking any better. 
could be out of gas. It's so old, I wouldn't hold it just falling apart. But how, uh, whatever it is, how are we gonna leave? Oh, what's happening here? So, yeah, man, sorry, but can we stay a while longer? That's unfortunate. As a matter of fact, I have to go to a nearby village to attend a memorial service for a few days. That's alright. We'll be out soon then. We wouldn't want to stay too long. Even without a car, we should find our walking, uh, our way walking. We could just leave the car and take the train home. No, no, it's quite all right for you to stay. I'm the only one who lives here, after all, and I would appreciate someone, uh, quite appreciate someone looking after it. Huh, really? Indeed, and you wouldn't get far walking into the mountains. Certainly not in all this far. You're my plea, you're more than welcome to stay until your car is fixed. Just please don't do anything dangerous like walking around in the mountains. Uh, alright, thanks, Gramps. Well, I've got to be heading out, keep an eye on any fires, and again, don't go walking in the mountains. Yeah, yeah. We'll halt down the court, don't you worry. Don't go down yourself, you hear? Uh, I'll be careful. So long. Uh. Hey, it's evening already. Better get in the bath first. I'll take you in after the guys. Just give me a moment. Because there are different endings to how everything is. So, if you go with the wrong ending, you'll die in game over, bad ending, etc. Whereas, in this particular part, there is, uh, in this particular part, there is um, a decision you've got to make of lighting a fire. I mean, I played this before because I really enjoyed this game. Where the hell's the weapon? I'm sure I can't find it. Um, because I played this game a good couple of years ago, so I can't exactly remember what decisions are what. Ew. Smash. It's really enjoyable. Oh yeah, that's the good thing. Couldn't really managed to relax yesterday, and having a huge bath like this is sweet. Wonder if Yuka's gonna be. Sucks that she's not feeling well. Kind of a waste of a trick. You bitch, your friends are, you know, dying in there. Mm, getting sleepy. Mm. <gasps> Daddy bitch. Hey, nice. Bazongos. Gee. Ah, the hell is this? The, the water's all gross. It wasn't the color when I got in. Not my fault, right? I'm not that dirty. Hey, what's the matter? <laughs> he enjoys the view. Yeah, I'm at way hey hey. What the hell are you budging in on me for? <laughs> for real, this is so nitty. Just how gross are you? Shut your horror mouth, bitch. That ain't the problem. The water just got all muddy. Poof, like that. Alright, just swamp then. Isn't this swamp water? Huh? And why would it be in the bath, genius? I don't know, maybe the plumbing oh, the plumbing screwed up. You know, the water leaks from the swamp into the bath. Then trigger happy at Christmas space bar. 
Well, no bats for a while. I guess we'll have to hold out till the old man comes back. I know. Damn it. What even? Ah, oh, this pisses me off. I'll check on you. You could then go to bed. Luke is trembling. Looks kind of pain. Is she gonna be okay? Oh well, let's go to bed. Remember, my cells are battery. Very good charging it. Charge my cells. Uh, all right, that'll do her. Bedtime. <laughs> I ain't no phone. <laughs> it's not a phone, guys. Not a phone. <sighs> Sleep. Oh, you're the coach. Yeah. I hear the water again. What? What in the fresh hell? This house is full of water. Right, just a dream. What a weird one. <gasps> Walrus! Huh? Was something there? It went towards Yuka's room. <gasps> follow the walrus! Let's follow that walrus. He will give us the answers. <gasps> I'll guess what he means. <gasps> walrus? No. No, it's not yours. Walrus. <gasps> you walrus, man. That's why you should never trust walruses. Mm, something about weird dream. I said trigger happy with the space bar. I'm sorry. I wonder if Yuka's up. I hope she's better. Yuka, it's morning. You feeling any better? You can go to the hospital if it's bad, okay? Yuka? Very funny sounds. Yuka, please come on. Oh, lovely lady. Hello, baby. What? On this music. Yuka, what happened to you? You were all swollen. Hey, wh what the hell? <gasps> Yuka, what, what is this? Rin, call an ambulance. Ah, 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 ambulance? There is a phone in the living room, hurry! Got it. Oh, mm -hmm. she's dead anyway. Aww, I can't go. I don't hear a thing. Why is it to be sure this thing busted piece of pipe at <gasps> Oh yeah, my cell's charged. Read that. Like seriously, that would have been quicker going to the team and getting this cell there for the thing. Mm, one one <laughs> one one nine, right? What? Oh, battery? But it's Plugged in, it's freaking charging, damn it! What's going on? 
we can't go limitless without a goddamn working phone. What the hell happened to Yuka? Her body's all swollen, skin all stiff. Oh, really? It makes her seem like a corpse. Shut the hell up! Yuka sure as hell not dead! And again, to the I apologize. Hey, what about Seto? Where'd he go? Oh, he wasn't his house. He's off looking for nearby villages or towns or anywhere we can call a hospital. Villages? Towns? No way there is there's any wa in walking distance. We didn't see any in the car, right? There is no way this far. Can't see more than a few meters in front. But what the hell do you propose then? Just leave Yuka how she is? You shut your hard mouth or I'll make you. Cicero, how would it go? No good. Can't see a thing in this heavy fog. I feel lucky I even made it back. You did look right. Of course I did. But this fog just makes it impossible. I didn't dare walk out without any signs. I mean, the old man was really insistent about us not walking out there, right? Uh, I guess that's what he meant, huh? Well then. Uh, well then what? You could, might. What if she dies? I don't want that to happen. N no, Yuka's fine. I don't think she'll die. Huh? That's the truth? She's got pulse, breathing, no fever, nothing's wrong except uh, other than external stuff. But she keeps mumbling she's cold. Not that, that it's any reason to leave her. We've got to get to the hospital soon. If we had just had a map, we could get around. How about we look for one? Uh, Alright, I'm sure we'll find one if we work together. Hey, by the way, say true, about the phone not working and the charger. Do you know why that happened? The house is old? <laughs> huh? Maybe it's either an outage or the guy forgot to pay his bill. Either way, power's out. You can't see how dark it is without the light, right? Yeah, it did seem dark, but why? It was working yesterday. How would I know? But how should I know? Still, Yuka takes priority right now. Gotta find that map. Yeah, I got it. We'll search the house together. We, we gotta help get Yuka help. Yeah, right. Right, this will be the end of this episode as that is 90% of the talking, more or less done it for the time being. I'm the Fat Girl and this is the beginning of Mermaid Swamp. For a special, special friend of mine, Insanity, <coughs> she requested me to do the Strange, uh, she requested me to do the uh, Strange Men series, which I will do for her after I have once done Mermaid Swamp, completed it and done all the endings. This has been the Fat Girl saying goodbye. Bye!